video or welcome if you are new. I'm currently at the Austin Airport waiting and I can't believe I'm vlogging in public right now. Like kind of without second thought. Maybe I've been at this long enough to not care. But I am here just for three days. Literally, I got here today. I'm here all tomorrow and then I leave on Wednesday. Today's Monday. And I'm here to do a photo shoot tomorrow with, and the reason it's in Austin is because I'm shooting with this photographer that's in Austin. And um, I had like a very specific vision for what I wanted for this shoot. And she was exactly what I wanted. I actually stumbled across her on my For You page. And at the time, didn't know that I'd be needing a photographer, but I like messaged her and I was like, would love to shoot with you sometime and then ended up having a reason to shoot with her and I tried to get her to come to like LA or Tampa but it just didn't work out that way and it worked best for me to go to Austin and honestly like I'll take an excuse to visit a new place any day of the week so I'm here in Austin and I'm super excited because I've never been. I've been to Texas but not Austin and it's a place that I've been wanting to go to. I've heard like really really good things about it so super excited for that and I'm also starving like I'm literally about to eat my arm so I'm gonna get food soon probably coffee because I woke up at like 4 30 a.m. and I am tired but I want to drink this whole water because I need to be good about drinking water since I'm traveling technically I've been traveling for about a week now because I've been in LA but I was very much like accustomed to that and I was going to workout classes and like cooking my own food and stuff and so it didn't really feel like I was in travel mode but now that I'm in this new place and everything like it definitely feels like I am actually in travel mode and I need to drink my water but anyways I will talk to you guys probably in a little bit probably when I'm getting food or coffee my photographer is like actually the best I'm gonna show you guys she also I'll have like all of her info down well maybe on the screen maybe down below I don't know but she made me a list of a bunch of recommendations for coffee food lunch dinner dessert like gay bars even of things to do while I'm here and it's honestly such a blessing because I'm probably just gonna go with her recommendations and like not really like spend time searching because I feel like I always end up wasting so much time like oh, I don't know where to go and then you're like okay well we've been looking for so long anyways so I'm super excited because I have like recommendations from someone who knows Austin well so I'm gonna listen to those I'm gonna get coffee and lunch apparently there's this like type of nut milk that's like popular here that I want to try and she recommended like a sushi place and then I think tomorrow after the shoot me and the photographer and then uh, I'm actually also going to be getting styled by this girl who seems incredible and she's going to style me in all these like really beautiful vintage pieces and I think all of us are going to go get dinner after the shoot and then I forget what time my flight is on Wednesday but I think it's later in the day so I'll probably also get coffee and breakfast the next day but I will take you guys along for everything and yeah also this airport it's not so crazy right now but when I landed it was like wild like there were so many people and I feel like so many people are like meeting up with like people here like everyone's like hugging and stuff like I'm, I'm confused this airport feels like very <laughs> <laughs> like live like why is everyone going to Austin on this Monday morning? Anyways, that's that. I'm so hungry, so hopefully I get food in my system. Peace out. Okay you guys, I'm far too obsessed with this room. I'm not gonna lie, there was a few tile colors and I was hoping for like red or like blue, I think was one of them. We got yellow, but honestly, I can work with it and it makes me, I really like the lighting, so I'm happy with it. But here at the hotel, little room tour. It's very small, little couch and then the bed, the little sink area, another view of the bed. And then the bathroom is beautiful as well. And then just have a 
little balcony. Going to go grab some lunch now. And I think I'm gonna go to this place called Two Hands, which has coffee and food. So that's what is sounding good, but I love this hotel room. It's super, super cute and I cannot wait. I think we're gonna take pictures in here unless it's too dark, then we're gonna go to the girl that's gonna style me's house because her, her, where she lives is like beautiful. So we'll see, but I really wanna get some sunglasses. Also, I changed. I wore these pants on the plane. These are from Aritzia and then the shirt is from Brandy, but um, I changed into this shirt from the t-shirt I was wearing. But anyways, to lunch I go. Hello you guys, I am getting ready for dinner now. I'm going to get sushi, I believe, at this place that my photographer recommended. And I'm also trying to tie the straps of this dress. <laughs> I'm struggling. <laughs> but I'm very excited because I have not had sushi since I was diagnosed. Because it's one of the foods that I was like blood sugar afraid of. Um, and it's like one of the only foods left that I have to like combat. So I'm looking forward to combating it. Um, okay, <laughs> I'm really struggling. But I showered and needed to wash my hair. So I'm literally gonna wash it again in the morning, I think, but um, I needed to wash it today. So gave it a good wash and I'm gonna style it because I wanna take pictures in this outfit. I feel like you guys are watching this, like, oh my God, girl, just tie the thing. I feel like that IRL too. But I'm wearing this little dress from Aritzia and I have these, it's like hard to see <laughs> right now, but I have these like bunch socks on and I have some um, loafers that I'm going to put on in a leather jacket. It's cute. And I might put my hair like half up, half down or something. We'll see. But first step, actually, first step is deodorant, not gonna lie. Okay. I have to keep this room clean because I think we're doing pictures in here, which reminds me, I actually have to answer some texts and <clears throat> plug my phone in. I just realized I don't have my curler attachment for my Dyson, but it's fine. I always do it with just this. I was going to switch it up, but this will do. Okay, you guys, here's the final bit. Blew my hair out. And then if you guys watched my packing vlog, you would have seen this outfit, but dress and jacket are from Aritzia, but this jacket's really old, so I don't know if you can still get it. But honestly, they probably have something super similar still. And then my scrunch socks are aloe. And then my loafers are, wait, I already forget. I don't remember, but I know I said it in my last vlog. Wait, I read it on the shoe last time. Oh, Tony Bianco. There we go. Anyways, I'm gonna go take pics and get sushi. Super excited, I'll show you guys what I get. I haven't had sushi in a long, very long time. So I'm very excited. Okay, back from sushi, and I tried so many different sushis that I've never tried before. Well, okay, that's a lie. I've tried raw salmon, but that's the only like raw fish I had tried, and I only tried it, I think, one time. Like, literally, I had like one piece, and I didn't get like a fair, a fair go around of it. <clears throat> so, Tonight, okay, well this is the food I got. So, started out with edamame. It was like spicy edamame. It was so good. Then I got miso soup, which was also really good. And I feel like sometimes it can be a little bit like dishwatery, but it wasn't, it was really good. And then uh, seaweed salad, which I did like exhale, exhale, until one of the seaweeds I didn't like. And then it threw me off and I couldn't get what it tasted like out of my mouth. And I couldn't eat any more. And then, then what? 
Oh, then I got chicken skewers, um, mostly just to add protein to help with my blood sugar. And it was actually really good though. It was like super tender and it came with like a really yummy sauce. And then I got a few rolls to try. So the first one had salmon in it. It was like salmon, avocado, I don't know, like kind of just that, but it had like sriracha and spicy mayo and something cr like crunchy and yummy on top. So I had that and that was really good. And then I got, it, it was like the roll, some of them had salmon, some of them had tuna, some of them had yellowtail and it was like on top and there was like imitation crab inside. I remember that was the, oh, the I don't remember, but all of them were really, really good. I think out of the, all the sushi, I liked the first roll that I got the best where the salmon was like inside, but then I really liked the tuna on top. I don't remember the exact names of like what it's called. But it was all really good and I love trying new foods and I was proud of myself because I know I mentioned, but that was the first time that I've had sushi since I was diagnosed and also on top of it, tried new foods that like aside from like diabetes literally just in my life, haven't tried. So that was super fun and then came back to the room, changed and I'm getting ready for bed because tomorrow is like the reason why I'm here. And I think the photographer and the girl that's gonna style me are coming over around 11, or no, sorry, 11.30. But before that in the morning, I really want to get outside, go for a little walk and grab a coffee and some food. There's like lots of restaurants and whatever like right here. So I wanna do that. And then tomorrow's gonna be like pretty much a full day of shooting. I think we're doing like five plus different looks. Um, so it'll definitely take a while, plus like some videos and whatnot, but I'm definitely gonna get some behind the scenes for you guys that I'll include in this vlog. And then also I wanna get some like on my camera roll and whatnot to like share on Snapchat, Instagram and everything. And then tomorrow night, I think me and everyone involved in the shoot are gonna go get dinner at this place. I think it's like a Mediterranean place. And then on Wednesday, I leave, but I forget when my flight is at, but I feel like it's later in the day. I think I mentioned that already earlier too. But anyways, that's my update for you guys. I'm gonna go to bed soon. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do though? I am gonna eat this. Oh, that's in the room because it sounds so good. So I really wanna try that. I was gonna get ice cream on the way home, but I don't, I've, I don't know how sushi's gonna um, affect the blood sugar of the next few hours, so I decided I was gonna get it another night because there's like a really popular ice cream place right here and I feel like I need to go while I'm here. But anyways, that's my update and I will see you guys in the morning for photo shoot day. Good night. I showed you my coffee this morning. I forgot to show you my breakfast, but it was literally just eggs, avocado, and bacon, and technically a salad, but I didn't really eat much of it. But I am all ready for the shoot, the photo shoot. And I'm going to, well, okay. The plan was we were gonna do it in the hotel room, like completely, but as you can see, it's kind of cloudy, and the room's very shadowy, so I'm actually gonna go over to the girl who's styling me's house and we're gonna shoot there, and then we are gonna come back because I really wanna shoot with the tile. So that's the plan, but later we're gonna do that. But I'm walking now to go get some sweet green before I head over because I know I'm gonna be there for a long time and I should probably eat something or else I'm gonna get hangry. And also I've had like <laughs> three or four cups of coffee and I'm still working on one, so in a few moments I'm probably gonna 
be shaking. So, need some food. lots and lots of behind the scenes but today was so much fun and I'm gonna put both Andre and Landis's information information who do I think I am info like in the in the description or on the screen I'm not sure where it'll be but it'll be around that they will also both be tagged in whatever I do post with them um, on Instagram whatever but so fun like literally a dream so fun but now I'm gonna go to dinner, so I'm wearing, well I changed, and uh, I think I told you guys where everything is from in my packing vlog, I believe. Um, skirt is from Revolve. I, okay, you can see your Revolve orders, and for some reason I can't find this in my Revolve orders, and I tried to link it on my Instagram story recently. This is for people, and I don't know where this is from, but. Yep, and I'm wearing my Sambas. And I'm just going to go down to the restaurant downstairs where I got breakfast because their food looks really good. And then I think I might get ice cream later to celebrate. But that's my, my little check-in with you guys.